and Dave. And together, with our dogs Belle and Hudson, we're exploring the world in our escape travel trailer. In the winter of 2023, we traveled from Ontario to Texas to pick up a 17-foot Casita trailer and spent over a month on the road. We liked it so much that by the fall of 2023, we upgraded to a 19-foot escape trailer so that I had space to work from the road. We haven't looked back since. Come see where we go next. After another week of working in Ottawa, I arrived home, Dave had the trailer all packed up, and we headed out to Sturgeon Bay Provincial Park. We got here on a Thursday night, and we're looking forward to this weekend because a number of our friends are actually going to be joining us here for the whole weekend. The rest of the group is set to arrive tomorrow night. So tomorrow during the day, I'll spend the day working from the campground, Dave will finish getting us set up, and then we'll be all ready to get our weekend started. I always enjoy working from the trailer, and this day flew by. It was full of meetings, and before I knew it, it was time to call it a day. Because we have some bigger trips coming up, I wanted to bring my workout equipment along this time around to test it out and see if there was enough space for it. And that way, when we're on a much longer trip, I can keep up my regular workout routine. After work was done for the day and my workout was also done, Dave and I took some time to relax by the water and enjoy the beautiful scenery. So it is Friday night and I'm done work for the day. Dave and I did get here last night, um, fairly late though, so we did a bit of setup um, right at dusk. But um, now we're just kind of sitting on the lakefront waiting for some of our friends to arrive. There's uh, three other couples coming to join us here this weekend. So we're looking forward to that. Usually we're out camping on our own. It'll be cool to be camping with some other people. You can see the uh, escape in the background there. We were lucky enough at this time of year to get a nice waterfront lot. And uh, yeah, looking forward to the weekend ahead. After we spend the weekend here, we're actually headed down through Ontario and we're gonna go through a number of different provincial parks. So we're looking forward to that as well. And uh, we'll keep you updated with some videos. Let's see what Dave thinks about this campground so far. Well, we're back here for a reason. I love it. And the weather couldn't be better. You'll see from the pictures and the videos. I think we're going to have an amazing weekend. I would agree with that assessment. Good girl, Bill. Boy, she's happy. Eh? Mm -hmm. She likes it here. I think she likes the combination of the sun and uh, the water. It's just the right temperature for her. It's everything she wants. Yeah. And she got good food today, so that's all that matters for her. <laughs> oh, good girl. Her tail's still wet. Because it's a Friday, everyone had to work today, so it was quite late by the time all of our friends got here, and it was dark outside, 
making it a little bit challenging for some of our friends to set up their tent. But after all of that was done, we were able to hang out and start catching up. Here. How many cups of water are you having? You know? I, have, I have eight ounces here. So, uh, <laughs> and then we'll fill it up. Enjoy the eight ounces. That's one, that's one cup of water. So my theory is do this. Just put a spoon and stick it to it. Yeah. Just it How do you do that, dude? Well, good. that's definitely going on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Loves, See? They love tree. See, I don't even notice it then. I, I well, you're Canadian. <laughs> it wouldn't be a night camping with friends without having a campfire and roasting marshmallows and wieners. <laughs> it's the carnival, it's well, the carnival. It's the it's carnival. The carnival. <laughs> it is a carnival. Y'all smell carny? Y'all smell carny for you. Y'all smell carny up in here. Hey, buddy. If we believe in you, just do it. You can do it later. You can do it later. As we were cooking the morning breakfast, the parents of some of our friends who were camping with us stopped in and the plan was that they were going to pick up their dog and babysit it for the rest of the weekend. Little did we know that this was going to result in some interesting challenges. Who's this, Claire? Is this your dog? Yes. What's his name? Max. What's his full name? Maxwell? <laughs> Clara, what's happening right now? Um, so my dog, he just locked the car. My grandparents, because my grandparents just came and they're taking my dog and the dog, my dog got in the front seat and he locked all the doors. Uh-oh. And the keys are inside and, the, and all their phones. What do you think we're going to do? I don't know. We, Dad said that we might have to get a wedge. And like high open or something, but I'm not sure if that'll work. Okay, tell the viewers to stay tuned to see what happens. <laughs> what? Is, what? Say, stay tuned to see what happens. Stay tuned to see what happens. Good. <laughs> oh, there's the maxi. Very relaxed right now. Yes, indeed, both sets of their keys were locked in their truck. The group stood around trying to decide what to do next, and eventually CAA was called. And you'll quickly see that they arrived and unlocked the door very quickly. Clara, look! It's unlocked! <laughs> now that the crisis was averted, it was time to start our day. Are you having fun so far? Yeah. Yeah? What are you hoping to do today? Swimming. Swimming? Yeah. Yeah, do you think the water will be cold? Maybe, maybe not. Hmm, we'll see, I guess. Eh? I'm gonna put water down the rocks. Oh yeah? Which yeah. rocks? There's over there? Big rocks over there. And it's gonna be like a waterfall. Well, that should be cool. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to trying that. Yeah. So you tell Matt what happened. Uh, maybe he should be down there, right? Water went all the way down. Okay, so is that what we're 
we're going to film? Yeah. All right. Should I go down at the bottom? Yeah. Oh, it's like a cool waterfall. Maybe we should try this one. Oh. Wait, there's one. another one over here. How lucky are we that it's the end of September and it's still so warm that we're all able to go swimming this weekend. Tracy, what did you find there? I found some shells. Can you show us? There's one right here. And the other ones, I think they're hiding in the weeds. Can you see if you can find one? Who's the designer of this gator? Uh, us. It's very impressive. Is this not a regular hobby? Uh, Ooh, that's, it sure looks that way. Watch the scale. Yeah, girls get the picture. Scarlett, Grace. We need all the creators. As the sun set on another beautiful day, it was time to make some mulled wine and sit around the campfire to relax. Ready? Ready. Ooh. Ooh. Oh! Ooh. Okay, this time. Let's go get Are you making a collar for the otter? Yeah, that's cool. Want me to help you, Gracie? Connect them? So you hold Mr. Otter, and I'll connect them. These weekends with friends never seemed to last long enough. And before we knew it, it was already Sunday morning. Clara, it's time for your interview. Clara, you're on camera with your skunk. Clara? Clara, what are your thoughts when you first wake up? Does it go back to sleep? <laughs> oh, yeah. Clara, it's time for your final interview. What's it called? Not a gyroscope. Are you ready? No, it's nine in the morning. Oh, are you awake? Yes. Well, that's the important part. So, tell me, Clara, what was your favorite part of the weekend? Sleeping in. Sleeping in? Yes. There's nothing else that was fun about the weekend? Okay, what was your least favorite part of the weekend? Mm. Did you swim, Clara? Yeah? Did you like that? Yeah, she had a mud fight there with Scarlett. Oh, and you built an alligator. So was any of that fun? Perhaps. <laughs> We all had one last hangout at the beach before it was time to head home. Every great weekend must come to an end, 
and so must every great summer. If you enjoyed this video, please consider hitting that like button. Or, even better, subscribe to our channel. It really does help us reach a wider audience. And don't forget to come back tomorrow to see where we go next.